Welcome guys, so Jose and I are talking about some stuff and I figured um, we could shoot a couple of videos around our 12.7 Detroit rebuild. So uh, it's kind of loud over here, but uh, Jose was just working on prepping the engine for the overhaul and for the counterbore. So do you want to maybe hop in and explain a couple of things? What are you doing here? Yeah, I like to prep it up for the guys uh, blocking the oil feed and oil drain holes. Yeah. So we don't get any foreign material in the oil galleries. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is the oil feed, oil drain. Same goes on the back, oil feed, oil drain. Even if you're doing a head gasket job, you always want to make sure you plug it up so no debris falls in there. Yeah. And yeah, uh, counter boards were done already. You can see the inserts. There's three more details right here. And the, uh, number two is the one that's really worn out. Can you explain the process of what he's going to do tomorrow? Yeah. Well, since this one already has these, he's gonna pop out this insert and he's gonna measure out the deck, measure out the block and uh, install a new insert, bore it down to this, uh, you know, to specs. Yeah. And if we need to put a shim in there, we'll put a shim in there on the liner, depending on what, what he measures out tomorrow. Okay. And yeah, and all six were done and all six are gonna be done tomorrow. And then after that, what's the next step after that? After that would be uh, prepping the liners and pistons, getting ready to throw them in there tomorrow. Okay. Well, it'd be more likely uh, Wednesday. You know, tomorrow he's going to be working it all day. Wednesday, prep the liners and pistons, bearings, get everything going. What do you think uh, time-wise? What, what can we... As in... Uh, to complete the whole... Complete over, the whole, over whole over what's right, like right an now? average that, uh, that's, that's like a good... Uh, counter boards one day, he's gonna do that. Uh, I would say like three days. Three days, right? Three days, yeah. Okay. So we're gonna start shooting. Uh, I would say I'll try to get some video tomorrow as he's doing, doing the counter boards. boards, and then uh, as we're putting it back together, um, we're gonna keep um, kind of just sh shooting videos as we go. But yeah, anything else you wanna throw in? Yeah, the reason for the counterboard job is that we noticed that one of the liners, cylinders, was uh, lower, which was on cylinder number five, on the Detroit, and uh, any other engine that's common, if you have a blown head gasket issue, you have a drop liner or a counterboard issue, so you want to get that addressed before just throwing another head gasket on there, or else you will blow out the gasket again. Yeah. So make sure, if you're getting a head gasket done, make sure you get your counterboards checked out. Liner height, liner procedure, they call it. Or else you will have that failure again. Awesome. What did we learn as far as the whole process? The truck's been down for a little bit because we've been busy, but now we're gonna uh, starting to pay more attention to it. You know, focusing on it a little bit more because we just tore it apart, and that was basically it. Yeah. And now, uh, so we're gonna get it done. But we pretty much everything have everything in. We yeah, everything's in sourcing stuff. for us. It was not allowed. Not allowed. Big issue. We got everything immediately. Yeah, and it's a really common engine, so yeah. that's no big deal. Okay, so we're gonna keep you posted and uh, shoot some more videos from our rebuild. Thank you for watching. Subscribe if you haven't. Talk to you soon.